affected the body in ways that you cannot even begin to imagine, right? When there were people, when there were wolves in sheep's clothing attempting to undermine and destroy, hurt and maim people, right, in the body, right? Try to hurt the body. It was Josh who took it on the chin. It was Josh who, who, who protected you, who kept us on the right track, who prayed over you, who um, kept wolves from devouring the flock. And I'm so thankful for that. Um, as a personal friend, as a person who speaks into my life all the time and all the things that God is using for, for Rachel and I, all of these things are true. And so I'm thankful for Christy and her, her, her relationship to Josh to support him all the way. I don't know how many nights we spent in, in rooms, all, well, in living rooms and then in the warehouse and then in rooms in here as God is leading. And, and Christy, man, like a single mom, just bearing the burden of that. So thankful and blessed by your hard work and the kids. And just the adoptions and watching, we're thankful. Right? But God is moving Josh really to pick up the leadership ball. A member of Good Standing in Library Church, thankful. We're not sending him out, but we're recognizing that God is calling him to lead and start a new ministry called Bay Light uh, Counseling Services, right? And so what I want you to do is I want you to just join me. We're going to alleviate Josh of his active elder role, and we're going to be just praying over him. God does that, right? So he's, he's building this ministry. He's working in this ministry. We're seeing God do amazing things in this ministry. We want to bless him in this ministry, and we want to encourage him in this ministry, but we also want to say, man, go, be, do what God has called you to do. So we're going to exchange this leadership. We're, in a few minutes, we're going to recognize a new uh, elder at Life Priest Church. And so, do you just thank the Lord for what God has used Josh to do as an elder? <laughs> Um, John Mazur, Johnny Mazur is uh, on a deep sea fishing deal, and we talked about that. At first, wasn't going to go once in a lifetime opportunity. We said go ahead and do that and with his boys, but I want to just, uh, I know, I know, but <laughs> instead of my getting soft, we'll get Johnny Mazur next week. Don't worry about that. But uh, I love this guy, I love his family, I'm thankful for him, and uh, we'll continue to serve alongside of him and be blessed and encouraged by his friendship and his uh, disciple making and the ministry that God has called to still. I mean, going to be plugged in, doing what uh, all of our members do here at Lightbridge, but again, as a as an active elder, we're saying, okay, man, it's time for you to do and build this ministry, okay, amen? amen? So I'm going to pray over him right now, let's do that. All right, Father, we love you, and we thank you for Jesus, our King, our Lord, and our Savior, Father, we thank you for the Walk family, we thank you for just the blessing uh, this body with their due diligence in serving uh, and loving this body well in leading this body well and, and everything that they've done, Father. I cannot imagine what it would have been like in the last, um, you know, getting ready to launch here in high school, what it would have been like without Josh by my side. And I'm thankful for him and encouraged by him. And thankful for what you're going to do in Baylight Ministries, Father. We're thankful for the counseling. We're thankful for the way that ministry is growing. We ask you to bless and encourage him in that. And that as he makes disciples in that ministry, bless him. And that lives would be transformed by the gospel. And for his family, encourage and bless them, Father. We're thankful for them as well. We love you and praise you for these things. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. We have a couple of things here to share with you. And uh, there you go. Thank you very much. That's for you. And then this is for you guys. I'll give these to you as well since you've got your hands full. And we know that you guys like to eat breakfast at Frog Pond, so there's a little something from Frog Pond here. Let me show the folks here. This is their little, oh, this is their little Frog Pond. Uh, uh, have you guys ever eaten Frog Pond? Yes. Okay, it's awesome for breakfast. But we gave a little gift straight to head over there. And, uh, and we're thankful for them. It's just a card signed by most of the folks in the congregation. We love you guys. Thankful for you. All right? Bless you. Give that back to me, I'm going to throw it one more time. All right. Okay, at the same time we, we do this, you know that we, we have a thing in our Constitution that um, is called a provisional elder. What we do is we feel like God has led us as a board of elders to kind of reach out to a guy that we think has the qualities and the long-term uh, 